parts of a cell the basic components of a cell are cell membrane cytoplasm and nucleus cell membrane different components of a cell are enclosed by a membrane called cell membrane this is also called plasma membrane this membrane gives shape to a cell the cell membrane separates cell from one another and also the cell from the surrounding medium the membrane is porous and allows the movement of substance or materials both inward and outward In addition to the cell membrane there is an outer thick layer in plant cells which is called cell wall This protects the plant cell against variations in temperature high wind speed atmospheric moisture etc Cytoplasm it is the jelly like substance present between the cell membrane and the nucleus various other components or organelles of cells are present in the cytoplasm these are mitochondria golgi bodies ribosomes etc nucleus It is an important component of the living cell, generally spherical and located in the center of the cell. Nucleus is separated from the cytoplasm by a membrane called the nuclear membrane. This membrane is also porous and allows the movement of the materials between the cytoplasm and the inside of the nucleus. With a microscope of higher magnification we can see a smaller spherical body in the nucleus it is called nucleolus in addition nucleus contains thread like structures called chromosomes these carry genes and help in the inheritance or transfer of characters from the parents to the offspring vacuole plant cell has one blank looking structure called vacuole in plant cell it could be single and big while vacuoles in animal cells are much smaller protoplasm protoplasm is the living substance of a cell and includes cytoplasm nucleus and all other organelles present in the cell plastids plant cells have very minute colored organelles called plastids plastids are of different colors green colored plastids contain chlorophyll and are called chloroplasts they provide green color to the plants